Pep, there is something always special about the Champions League and now it's back. Are you looking forward to it? Of course. Of course. It was a special competition for everyone. Pleasure to be here, of course. What do you look forward to the most when the Champions League returns, especially this stage of the competition when you get to the knockouts? It feels like it's the business end of the season, doesn't it? Well, I feel a bit the pressure, so uh, we know what... Uh, I, I will make a, a lot of compliments about that team, what we saw the last days uh, in group stage. Maybe it was the second toughest. Uh, part of Newcastle, uh, Milan, and uh, you know the other one with uh, Bayern Munich, uh, Man United, and uh, Galatasaray, and go through and through. And I saw a few games of them, and the reason why I went through it, the reason why. Mm -hmm. So because they are many many things, and always here stuff. I've been with uh, when I was playing national team from Spain, and and here and never I think never won. It's a difficult place to come, but at the same time ready to take a good result and try to finish the job in a few days in Manchester. Why is it a tough place to come, do you think? Can you put your finger on why? The stadium, the grass, uh, and especially the way they play, the intensity. Denmark is already a national team, always they have a good level. And uh, they're incredibly well organised and yeah, you have to read perfectly what you have to do. Well, your team arrived for this game <coughs> on a 10-game winning run. Hmm. Do you feel like you have the momentum coming into this? Yeah, we're fine, but I said before everything, I have to prove it again, so don't give you a good result tomorrow, the fact that we won 10 games, we have to do it again, not the results in the last season helps you to do what you have to do. What we have done so far, we won it on the pitch, so we have to do it again. Well, Man City tried, as you know, for so many years to win the Champions League and <coughs> you've now finally done it. Yeah. <coughs> Why is it so difficult to win? Because... Uh, <laughs> It's simple. They are an unbelievable team and unbelievable players, and everyone wish it and want it. And yeah, it's so difficult, especially for the team like never won it before and didn't have much experience. So, but I see the players in the team now comparing when I arrived eight years ago, like uh, coming here or going in bigger stages like Barcelona, Madrid, or whatever. It's like I, uh, I think we could, we didn't believe it that we could compete. Now I had the feeling that we can lose. But we can be there, not being scared or respect the opponents, of course, but face them with, uh, OK, let's, let's try it. So that is, I think, the big gap that uh, it, this gap always, this gap was reduced, always happened when you play year by year this competition. The experience and the defeats and the painful you have in your body and, and many things help us to grow up and, and be in the position that we did the last, the previous seasons. Like in three years, two finals, one semi-final, so that means that we learn from the past. Now you have won it. <coughs> How are the players feeling? Do, can you sense as their manager that maybe there's a weight lifted off their shoulders? I've won it now. Obviously, they want to go and do it again, but do you sense that a weight has lifted? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Every single question before uh, a Champions League and press conference, why, yeah, yeah, it's so good, but you didn't win the Champions League. Why are going to win the Champions League? So this is never again the and <laughs> that is nice, I would say. But in the same time, knowing the players, so they will try to, to take uh, step by step. Now the target is reach, uh, you know, with quarterfinals. So that is the target. So that's why it starts tomorrow. And you know what the next question is going to be then? No one's asking you can you win it? It's can you defend the title? How different is that feeling now coming into well, this until, season? I don't know which day is the, the final of the Champions League, but until then we are the, uh, the king, no? We, we, retain, we have the title, so belong to us for a few more months. So, and we are going to defend this title where we have to. It's on the pitch and doing our best. It's not much complicated to understand it. So the players, once we are there, they want to try it, that's for sure. I know them. I know them quite well. When you won it last year, it secured the treble. And I know you've already said 99.99% yeah. you won't win the treble again. But that does mean there's a 0.01% <coughs> that you can do it. It's not yeah, impossible, is it? Yeah, you have to take it for that. But I'm right when I said <laughs> I'm right. But yeah, it's much you have a, you know, a ridiculous percent. We have to, to fight, but always when I play this competition, <coughs> Barcelona by Munich here, in these stages, especially, especially the first game in the last 16, 
when it's the last game you play Champions League game was long time ago in group stage. So many things happened since November, December until now. So the first is uh, people say, yeah, you won in Lisbon, you won zero five zero six. Yeah, it was five shoots and target, five goals. I'd always have been tricky. In Barcelona, I suffered a lot in my first two seasons, the first game, in Bayern Munich as well, because it's still this, okay, a little competition, last 16. So that's why you have to be careful tomorrow, uh, how is approach mentally approach and read what you have to do. Um, and, and go, you know, step by step to try to reach this ridiculous percent. You spoke to me before about players needing rhythm. You face the Copenhagen side tomorrow who haven't played for two months in any competitive no. football. It's quite unusual. They're fresh, but maybe the rhythm is a little bit different. I've never been two months and after playing official different competition like that. But uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how they will feel. But uh, that's for sure. They are starving to compete and, you know, to play. In the state does. We have <laughs> many games already in our legs and our bodies. But this is what it is. So adapt and the positive things and the bad things and try to adapt it. You are the team to beat, but do you like that? Well, I don't know if uh, we are in front of uh, other elite teams, like could be, of course, Real Madrid, the king of this competition or other teams. So I don't know. But of course, we, re we have the last champion. And for sure, like in Premier League, they want to beat us. And that's normal competition. It's normal like that. So last season, we played against Madrid that won the previous one, I think so. And we want to beat them. You know, we wanna. So that is normal. It's not a problem.